Borg are moving in on. Now they need to concentrate fire on this Star Yard. Uh, in the meantime, th this, this these Tavares are not going to be able to take it down nearly enough. Concentrate firepower on this stuff. They are concentrating firepower on things that can, can be repaired. Um, however, they are looking to take out some of the offense here. Oh, and a lot of beams going off as tons of stuff take damage, but you can see nothing really getting killed out. One of those frigates going down. Um, these guys are trying to do a little bit of attack on these guys. Down goes another Reans. Just a ton of damage going off here on these guys. Um, needing to get some kills here. Down goes one, a couple of these. All of these trying to go repair, and that is sort of a, a bit of a problem here. Here comes these guys. Oh, and some of these guys are getting just taken out. Piecemeal here a bit. As these Reans come in on the side of these guys, and the boar moving in on these guys. Do not attack a repairing ship. Never attack a repairing ship. As these Reans coming in on the backside of these bombers, avoiding the fire. These micro of Sergio's micro is just bar none, really saving the day here. The Borg, are, they are getting things drawn off these Tavares, moving away as the Rians really just tearing through those bombers, cost, making very, very costly. And these bombers are going to try to re-engage on the Borg. The Borg are going to, uh, don't want to deal with these Tavares. Now let's see, where are those Rians again? Those Rians could come in a very nice handy here. Um, this bomber going to end up losing its life. This guy, the... Uh, Rhymelins coming in with a pair of Tavares. Going to be able to put a lot of pressure on the Borg here. Uh, losing against the Bombers. As down goes the Sim. In the meantime, a juicy target here awaits as the Rhymelins move back to base. But they are going to get a... What the really Zergil needs is a forward base. Uh, in the meantime, he's got this one... Oh, poor veteran, sitting it out. As it has no uh, no engines and no, uh, no sh well, not much of anything. Tavares moving across the board, followed by some bombers. A trio of these C-17s also going to pack some punch here. Borg moving all the way across the map. Trying to get back into range of their starbase, getting them to retreat. Um, I don't know what tech they have. Let's see if I can determine. And no, I'm not going to be able to see. That is unfortunate. In the meantime, C7, ooh, C17 still in the production here. Going to be able to do a decent amount of uh, damage as a. Norexian coming out. This pulse, the pulses off of this guy are are not really that great against uh, the boar because they have larger vessels. They take a lot less damage from those pulses, but that is going to be able to counter the earlier game, Rhymelands, as those pulses will be doing decent against the small. Got this one veteran almost ready. Someone bring a constructor here, please. Uh, Zerja trying to eke out a living on what he has. He's got the secret not so secret base because uh, there is a scout in here somewhere you can see it on the minimap oh right there Sergio doing just an excellent job of scouting you can just see how much he can see Sergio not doing near as much as he needs but trying to do a little with what he has So, back again, we have the what looks like the left-hand team in a decent position, also putting up another construction yard, slowly amassing just a ton of forces. As the Romulans, where are the Romulans? Romulans up here with some of their Spectre refits moving around. Here's some Tavaras looking to put a killing blow Onto the onto the Romulans because they really have just been micro to death and just outmaneuvered by Zergil's just stupendous use of uh, his disruptor reins. Reins as these Tavares are slowly uh, moving around. You can see the Borg on the minimap moving together with their much smaller fleet than before. Sergio seeing. 
seeing that with, again, his excellent scouting, really, again, paying off. These Tavares coming to move in on the Rhymelands, right into their dilithium mining, and this could hurt as up here. You can see Sergio has also, in the meantime, burned through another set of uh, Zergil's mining. This is, again, going to hurt. He's going to do a two-prong, uh, maybe not, attack. These Tavares sitting down here, not doing anything. Borg moving over here into Zergil's mining. In the meantime, have a bit of a fleet here as these guys are trying to get a little bit of a kill off here. And here comes some Tavares doing some raiding over in the main. Zergil being forced back to Borg in the meantime, just burning through things here. And... Um, here are the Dominion, cutting off the Borg's retreat. Tavara moving in on Zergil's main, putting just a ton of pressure on him. This is going to probably be the decisive in battle, especially right here. The Borg are just going to get slaughtered. And here we go. Down goes an adapter. And these guys are just getting slaughtered left and right. You can just see the Borg are not able to put out the DPS they need and they are focusing now on that diamond. That diamond going to be one of the more expensive and they need to get that kill off on this diamond if they want to really put in the towel on this guy. Guy able to move back. Borg should sort of micro their fleet a little bit as the uh, pink beam of death making its way onto the field. The diamond getting eaten up as the Tavares moving down over towards the Borg, the Borg are looking a little bit like they are hurting for um, much of anything. The Borg just not putting out enough of the enough ships here to counter this. So we have a two-prong Raman fleet. These pair of Tavares moving slowly down here, looking into the backside of the. Uh, Borg base going to get some kills off of this guy there. Not going to be nearly as scared of that Borg fleet knowing that the Dominion Arc knocking on the front door coming in through the front as these Rhymelands coming in through the back. Looking another two prong attack, maybe a three prong attack here very shortly as Sergio decloaks here going to draw Zergil's attention away. Where is Zergil's fleet? Zergil's fleet is. I don't know where Zergil's fleet is. Zergil's fleet may be decimated. Um, yeah, I don't see Zergil's fleet at all. It looks like, oh, here it is Zergil's fleet coming up over here. In the meantime, the Borg are getting just destroyed by this Dominion fleet using these C-17s and these bombers to just shell the crap out of them. And the Tavara is also going to be coming here on the backside. Just slapping everything around. Three-prong attack is just... Wow, Sergio's micro is uh, turning out very nicely, allowing him to be two places at once while his Dominion ally is doing uh, a ton of damage on the Borg here, taking out the front side. Um, and the Borg are retreating back to their assimilation matrix. Really, they are not going to be able to fight this. As this... Uh, one uh, Leoval trying to make a difference here. Maybe distract it, draw it back. Not going to be able to do that. And um, here we have 